He always walked like an old man. Like I said, it's so loud. You didn't hear it. He always walked like an old man. Like I said, it's so loud. You didn't hear it. Mm. What we were doing today was blow art and what the children were doing, or young adults, excuse me, were doing, was blow art and then inter, intermingling them and then choosing a word, selecting a word for the weekend that would empower and remind them of the weekend and something that they learned, their takeaway for the weekend. So each was responsible for selecting a word. And Giannis, you can see his color of mixture of cool and warm and so like the patience was one of the words that um, will bring him back to this weekend. And over here, Jaden chose potential as, as his, even as he mixed up his colors. Mm -hmm. um, but the word that he selected was potential. And over, the, over here, the word that was selected was strong. And um, in our last person who selected to um, who added his own creative expression to it and moved from one word to a phrase because he couldn't contain it into one word okay so that you know he had a little little challenge with it but what he selected was who's that was the process surprise this, me Jaden no, Jaden did potential. Okay, so who's that? Kenny. Kenny. Okay. Kenny, Looks like so, a mess to me, but. Yeah. So at each of them explained their reason for their selection. So you may want to talk with them and interview them and find out why they actually selected those particular words and those terms that they thought was most appropriate to highlight the weekend. Okay. Thank you. About the words you used in your painting, explain it to me. Okay. So I use uh, trust the process because in life, um, you know, you go through a lot of difficult paths and life is not easy. So when your time comes, you need to like be patient, trust the process, like just work and keep working hard. And then when your opportunity comes, you need to be prepared for it. And that's and I think that was like the maxim of this week because during, uh, for example, Giannis, my, uh, one of my post teammates, he, he had uh, two bad games, but he got traded and his coach uh, was um, leading him through the, like, the game. And those like six games, he was like going off, dropping 30, left hand, right hand, and he was just doing good. So that was like, that was, yeah, that was like a good word to use in my opinion. Okay, Jaden, how about you? Tell me about your work. Well, my paper, you can see in the aura, it's very bright and it's very vibrant. And the word potential it has to do with the word and how the word is used and how the word is misused and how it's overused. And potential, I think, in my opinion, is when something doesn't have great value but can have great value someday when you have, when you put work into it. So potential is just really, it's just really a what if for a lot of stuff. And I think that's how it's misused and overused. Okay, thank you. Giannis, you wanna to add to your work? Uh, my word is patience. And it's just talking about like, just letting things happen and being patient and not like rushing anything and just letting time do its thing. Like trust the process. It's like, like that. Also my colors, are like outer space like it looks like a nebula so that's come it goes in with like time and everything so yeah it's like it's like kenny's trust uh trust the process and just letting things happen and not rushing okay thank you gentlemen you did very well the pulse experience